So of all the ceiling fans in my house, everyone I can get, we're gonna start with this Aerospec Climate Industrial Ceiling Fan. No distractions, cause I've done three takes of trying to record these fans, but now I see why I haven't made one of these in nearly a year now. It's just so frustrating. And the editing, ugh. and it takes forever to get the video like joined together for me, cause I don't have that equipment. So, low. Now this is a low quality fan, uh, the, the shade broke and it wobbles a bit, it actually came with a broken shade, I didn't break the shade, like if I could find the box, I would show you one, it, it's, it has a sticker they put on it that says broken shade, anyway that's low speed, uh, there's the light, uh, medium, usually I just, uh, that stupid door, um, yeah, that's medium. The fa all the fans in this house wobble. Like, nearly all the fans here wobble. Uh, this fan's never been balanced. It's wobbling right now, but you can't really see it on camera. You have to look super good. Like, you have to have sharp eyes to see it wobble on camera, but in real life, it's wobbling. Uh, here's high. And yeah, it has those hour setting things. Uh, that's good, but I don't think I should trust a cheap fan with an hour setting because that could lead to a fire maybe because this is a cheap fan. Like, we got it for extra cheap. And I'll turn it off. Oh, where's that off button? There it is. I'm going to turn it off and have a switch. Uh, industrial fan up there. Uh, no one really cares about that fan, so I never really plan to record it unless I put it up, so. This is, we all know this fan. Josh D really likes this fan. Josh D, if you ever watch my videos again, I, uh, I would give this fan to you if I could, but uh, I don't know how to ship things. Maybe if it gets taken down, I'll see if I can fix it up and sell it. But I don't know how to ship things to one person. So I have a, like a ton of rare fans. Like I have like two rare ceiling fans that I need to sell. I can't fix them up. I have a KDK, E14 GK, and a Sears Roebuck thing, I don't know, and I have two, like, most of the fans in this house are cheap, I have two, oh, wait, wait, okay, let's just get to the ceiling fans that are in the ceiling, I use an air conditioner instead of that, okay. uh, sorry if you hear the vacuum cleaner, this is a belly ceiling fan, I'm not going to turn it on because it wobbles. I have two, there are like three of these, there's another one in the room there, but I'm not going to show you that one. Uh, this is another battery fan, with, with the blades are a bit saggy. They're saggy than they look, but... Alright. If you're wondering where all those e weapons go, here it is. Oh, and these are the real shield. Okay. Um, the golf cart. Can I make another video? Um, because my old one didn't work. They stopped me from recording. This is another fan, but I'm not gonna turn it on speed because it takes so long. Uh, that was a belly ceiling fan. The doors aren't closing. It's very windy. So as you see here, leaf blowing and stuff, all this stuff is going to be cleaned up. Uh, so I'm going to show you guys the Panasonic ceiling fan upstairs, which I made a separate video of that by itself and it got so many views. I love it when my videos get 1k views, that's so rare. Here it is. Uh, if I ever have the time, I'll make a video of it and I'll set it to uh, third time. Because those videos get so many views. So many. So, it, it hums and it's not a dimmer. This is the original switch it came with. So that's high. I'm only going to set it to five, which was here. Five was here. Three, which was here. And one which was here and had other speeds in the middle. There's a four speed which was 
I sometimes get three or five. So this is speed five. It has the it might be the capacitor that's the problem because this fan. If you saw how dirty the blades was before I turned it on, this fan is disgusting. Like the blades have this. It's a like that dust is probably goopy. Like that gloopy dust you get on industrial fans. I made up that word. I just, I can't really describe that dust. I've cleaned it off before. It's like black dust on it. So, so here's three. Oh yeah, we have a light. We have lights here too. Those don't work. And one. Yeah, that Panasonic fan is one of the best fans I can really record. I have a second one, but... Alright. Get the camera adjusted. Here is a... What's this company again? Royal Pacific ceiling fan with... I forgot, some unknown ceiling fans housing. It's not a Casablanca, it was, I don't even remember what company it was. Uh, this fan has capacitor issues, it doesn't work anymore. I think only the light's connected now. And I'm not gonna even think about clicking the switch because I feel like it's gonna explode or something. That's a joke about the explosion, but it might do something. So, yeah, hopefully I'll, when this fan's removed, it won't get thrown away and I'll get it. Faster issues. Okay, what are we done here? Oh, uh, okay. Oh, that beat always scares me. Alright, we've got this Honeywell Marston Sealy fan. At the other side, the Honeywell logo's on it, just so you can tell. I like when companies actually put their logos on their fan. I hate windy days. I always hate them, they ruin my videos. So, yeah. I can't turn it on because I don't know where the remote is. It's not in its holder. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Those are all the fans of the house. Um, oh, and we're going to be putting that um, Westinghouse Princess in the laundry room. I'll make a video of that. So, thanks for watching. Bye. Um, and expect the golf cart to have a rink gym. Bye.